All right, so it's one of so it's one of those days. We right now we're playing Call of Duty World War Two um, or WW Two. Um, so we're gonna play mode zombies. Uh, I usually play a single mode. I'm going to show you more or less about uh, how to survive into the mansion ghost house I, I'm not really sure how it's called so the bear first uh, we gotta solve a few easter eggs which involves uh, shooting 10 lamps around the house uh, there's a total of 10 of them so uh, I gotta keep the eye on them they're like there are two of them outside I think I'm shooting them right now and there's another eight inside so you gotta Keep the eye for them. It's like just the way I'm showing you. They're they're, they're never move. Just shoot them all, and uh, you open up a room on the on the left, which contains the mystery box. Uh, the mystery box for those that don't don't really know about it. There's a box that can open up and get really good game uh, good weapons. So. Um, they, they all cost a thousand each, uh, a thousand points. So, uh, okay, I just got my first thousand. And uh, let's get first weapon. Uh, usually, the next, um, the next Easter egg evolves. Oh, nice, nice weapon. Thank you. Um, yeah, the next, the next Easter egg step will be uh, getting a, uh, uh, Jack in a box, which uh, usually comes in in a very third, second or third uh, chance uh, buying the, the mystery box. Um, so the Jack in a box is very, is very important for this Easter egg. Next step, uh, and also it can lure your zombies around and uh, protecting yourself, just like I will show you. Uh, next couple minutes. Um, so now I'm still trying to get my thousand, my other thousand points to get my next chance. Ugh, so far, so good. There's a lot of zombies around. Um, okay, the round gets intense around the fifth or sixth round. So far, so good. Yeah, I got instant kill. Alright, second chance, let's see what's going on. Okay, wrong just went by. Oh, you see? You just saw the jack in the box. Oh, well, okay, second time, no worries. Alright, this one's a pretty good weapon. Uh, for maps like this, I would suggest uh, weapons with really, really high quantity of bullets and also potent uh, damage. Uh, I usually use uh, light machine guns. I know there's others that uh, uh, for short range, or definitely also use a shotgun because they help because they help a lot. Uh, well, there's other people that well that they like using the tactical weapons, like lighter guns, AK-47 and other models. Uh, so. Yeah, it's, it's my preference. Like machine guns, it's my thing. Because they have a lot of weapons, and, and well, better said, they have a lot of bullets. Uh, and also, they're potent. Okay. I guess, what am I? Second, third now? What? Okay, no problem. No problem. Uh, yeah, I usually just create my strategy with, with a max ammo box. But uh, I guess I still don't have that. Oh, nice. Perfect. Jack in the box. Thank you very much. Let's do this. Um, soon enough, as soon as I clear out this out uh, here, I proceed to the next part of the Easter egg. God, it's intense here. There's a lot. Of oh my god. Alright, uh, here we go. <laughs> yeah. Like, kinda. You gotta dance around them so they don't hit you. 
Alright. So. Alright. Mm. Here, almost done, almost done. Okay, okay, perfect. Perfect. I like that. There we go. So this is it. Uh, look at that guy staring at you. <laughs> it's crazy. Alright, so that's the next step of the strike. I was just waiting for some more zombies, just to attract them. Well, I guess I didn't do much. Um, well, that's the next step for the Easter egg. Just to... Um, and now we gotta get 10,000 points. Um, which, that involves a lot of killing. And a lot of saving money. Uh, some people I just don't like to uh, do that investment just because like it takes a lot of money but once once you look at it hey like that's pocket punching your your weapons so like every weapon you get to buy after doing that investment um, you can get all your weapons pocket punch uh, off the mystery box so I'll show you that um, it's not 10,000 points that you have to invest there it's just that look at that all knuckle down just like stocks of wood <laughs> that's funny um, so yes uh, like I was saying it causes actually uh, 9,999 points which is 9999 points okay so you should I get that like just before round night. Uh, just before round nine, maybe around round eight, depending. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, is this gets really intense here. Holy, a lot of zombies here. Oh, oh my god, like it was almost like kissing me. <laughs> No homo. <laughs> Alright, uh huh. Uh huh. Ouch. No touchy. <laughs> Alright. So good to go, good to go here. Alright. Yeah, yeah. Organized here. A little bit. Let's get everything situated. Mm. Grenades there. Uh huh. Not much. Not much. Not much here. Not too busy. All right. Well, level way seven. Almost six six thousand points. Huh. Might get that. Like maybe. In the next round or so before that. Oh, you see that? <laughs> That's just nuts. Okay. Alright, get the heck out of here. Alright. Let's get some arm everywhere. Wait. Uh huh. Okay. Let's do this. Uh oh. Wow. Uh huh. Oh, nice. Perfect. That's my trick right there. Uh -huh. Throw all my all my jacks, so they reach them before before the max ammo goes, and then I pick up more because you don't get to have any more after you spend them all, unless you get a max ammo. Perfect. All right. <laughs> Oy, not easy. Yes, yeah, so I can show you some some uh, boats here. In order to survive in a, such a short place like this, such a small spot, um, you first you gotta move fast. You can't stay in one spot because uh, zombies are everywhere. They're gonna try. To, well, they're gonna try to get you. And yeah, basically that's why you gotta move fast. The second step is having good weapons. Um, well, whichever you, you think is, they're good weapons. 
Uh, you gotta have the, the jack in the box too. Very important. Um, the third, the, the the third step here to survive is also having good perks. That I can explain that in another uh, video. Uh, the first step here, you gotta remain calm, just like you see. There's two zombies here, uh, like oh my god, and they inside. <laughs> um, yeah, and uh, the fifth step here is like you gotta, you gotta like a hey, play around and all, like, just do the the Easter eggs. Oh wow, and uh, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Just poker punch your, your weapons, everything. Here, for example, I gotta do my investment with the piano. Boom, 9999 gone. And my first weapon. I usually use the save up 11, 11,000 just for that. I able to get my second, my first bunker punch weapon. Oh my god, I don't like snipers. This is a house, <laughs> for God's sake, you know? Uh, well, I guess this is it. Whatever that is. I'm gonna get my next weapon soon. Uh, I need something else. I need something quick, like whatever, whatever that is. That uh, shoots fast. Fine. Uh, soon enough. Uh, here we go. Yep. That's good. I'll survive. Yep. That's the way it goes. Yeah, you see, keeping calm and uh, nothing will affect you. Like no matter which level you are. You can reach up very high. So if you have positive thinking, then you can get like the proper weapons, your favorite weapons, whatnot. Something really good that can help you out, right? So okay, here you go. My next, my next weapon I can have there. Switch. Oh my God! Here we go. One of my first, one of my favorite weapons. Just like I was talking about it. <laughs> Perfect. Um. Okay. So it was a pleasure talking to you guys. Enjoy.